These are the Toysman Duo Max plasterboard fixings. I actually picked these up from a local hardware store. And sometimes you don't always need the world's strongest plasterboard fixing. You just need one that is quick, easy to use and is going to work. So we're going to test these out. And then once I've used them, I will actually do a test in a few weeks that will show you exactly how much weight these can hold before the plasterboard or the fixing fails. To use these, it is very simple. All we need to do is drill a 10 millimeter hole through the plasterboard and then tighten the screw up. You can have used a screwdriver or a small drill for doing that. I'm gonna start off by taking the bracket that we're gonna fix. I'm gonna put that in the correct position. And I have marked the plasterboard already. This is just a mock-up petition that I've put up in the garage. And I'm gonna mark the two fixing holes. I'm not just gonna drill through there using a 10 millimeter drill bit. And then we just need to take that part, push that through the hole. Might actually just need to put the screw in to get it through. I'll now do the same with the top one. Now we've got those in position, I'm just gonna undo the screws. And then I'm just gonna use a penny washer because the holes in the brackets that I'm using are quite large. And then I'm gonna position the bracket and I'm gonna screw those back into position. And I can use a cordless drill on the bottom one. We don't want to go mad when we're doing that. And then for this one, we're gonna to have to use the right angle attachments because of the shape of the bracket. And with any fixing like this, it is important to do the final tightening with a screwdriver so that you know just how tight you are going. I'm now just gonna repeat that on the second bracket. So again, I'm gonna put it in the right position. And then I'm just gonna mark the two fixing holes. I'll then just pop a 10 millimeter hole through there. I can then take the fixing, push that through the hole. Now remove the two screws. Again, I'm using the two penny washers. Can then push those through the fixings and we can tighten those up. And then finally, I'll tighten up the screws using the screwdriver. If you found this video useful please give it a thumbs up and it would be incredibly helpful if you could share the video and if you've not done so already please subscribe to the channel. So that's the Thorisman Duo Max. They are definitely one of the easiest plasterboard fixings that you can use. In a few weeks time I will do a test and we'll see just how much weight these brackets can take using those fixings and we'll see how much weight it can take before the plasterboard fails.